I'm Shredmaster Scott, and this video is called Hell's Bells in Every Mode. We'll take Angus Young's timeless riff and reinterpret it using each of the seven diatonic modes. You're crazy, Shred. <laughs> Hell's Bells in Every Mode, music by Antichrist Devil Child. Antichrist Devil's Children, that's what we stood for. So we got the original riff first up, no sharps or flats. Let's have a listen. These eight pedal tones are really important. It's really kind of an ambiguous sound. It's like it's in between Dorian and some sort of natural minor. Therein lies the brilliance of the riff. That sort of ambiguous quality you'll find in a lot of hit songs. Black Sabbath is amazing at doing this as well. It's like it lets the listener fill in the gaps for themselves. Definitely not something shred guitar players are good at. All right, next up, uh, let's get into the heinous territory of the Ionian or major mode. We've got three sharps, so we're raising the third, which is that C sharp, and the G sharp, or the seventh. Don't think we're gonna get Hell's Bells going here, but maybe some Heaven's Bells? <laughs> okay, Dorian. So with Dorian, we just have a raised sixth degree. That's the only difference between the original. Super cool sound, a little bit jazzy, good stuff. Ring me those bells, Angus. Phrygian is always dark and twisted because of that flat second degree. Got B flats happening here, and then at the end, again, uh, emphasizing that B flat, flat second degree. Very dark and twisted, which is what we like. Lydian is a major mode, uh, so you've got A major and B major chords that you're trying to bring out here. That's the chord formula. It's a horrible thing, and you know the yes. hope okay. that it it gets better. So if none of this is making any sense, I actually have a whole course on the modes in the description below. It's called Modal Mayhem, and it goes into a lot more depth on these topics. Mixolydian. So we've got another major mode here, two sharps. Uh, a mixolydian would be relative to the key of D. And we can keep that flat seventh degree. We don't have to change that. We're just going to mess with that C or third. So we're gonna take the C up to a C sharp. Aeolian or natural minor. Uh, the key here is to emphasize the flat sixth or the F natural degree. I'm doing that again in this ending cadence. Aeolian brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> what? A shred never cries. Okay, Locrian, ultimate vicious brooding evil. It's a horrible thing. <laughs> We've got the flat fifth and the flat second degree happening here. There it is. Ending on this tritone chunk, it's just maximum evil. Now you guys have been asking for some outside sounding modes like harmonic and melodic minor. So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, this is one of my favorite outside sounding modes, Dorian sharp four or the fourth mode of the harmonic minor scale.
So A Dorian sharp four is gonna be relative to E harmonic minor. You got that D sharp in there. Uh, a minor and B major chords characterize this mode, so it's a great sound. It's like, uh, to me, it sounds like haunted house. And lastly, we've got melodic minor. So with uh, A melodic minor, you've got a raised seventh degree, that G sharp, and then also a raised sixth degree, or the F sharp. Melodic minor is kind of like, uh, it's used in metal sometimes, like Mashuga will use it. It's like twisted, just kind of generally creepy, which is what we like. <laughs> and there you have it, Hell's Bells in every mode. If you can learn to think this way, you'll unlock a tremendous amount of musical power in your plane. Now, I actually have a whole course on the modes if you really want to take your game to the next level. Modal Mayhem is the most comprehensive course available on the topic. You'll learn all the scales, chords, and even how to harmonize using modes. I'll leave a link in the description below. And until next time, shred till you're dead. Antichrist, devil's children, that's what we stood for. And it was Tipper Go, that was her. <laughs>